The British Isles has nearly 20,000 miles of rugged coastline. And living in our waters are over 25 species of whales and dolphins. On a good day, you might be able to spot a small group of dolphins or a harbour porpoise close to shore. But I've just had a tip-off. Out in the Bristol Channel, over a 1,000 common dolphins have just been spotted in what's technically known as a super pod. And I'm hoping to catch up with them. It's a rare occurrence when dolphins come together in such a huge group, and you need expert help to find them. So I'm heading off from West Wales with the crew from Sea Trust, a local marine conservation group who've spent the last 10 years surveying the marine life in the area. Cliff Benson is the senior researcher. The conditions today look pretty good. Um, how often are you catching up with these super pods? Super pods, we don't catch up with that often. Over the years, I think we've had that on four occasions and hopefully again today. The Bristol Channel is a safe place for the dolphins as they have no natural predators here. There's also an abundance of plankton, which in turn attracts mackerel and herring for the dolphins to feed on. And it's not long before we see a good sign that dolphins could be nearby. We've just spotted a load of gannets plunging in from way up top. And that means, obviously, there are fish down below. And whether there are gannets above, almost certainly there'll be dolphins catching the fish in the water as well. As we race over towards the birds, we get our first glimpse of dolphins in the distance. Look at the number of dolphins coming here. Look at this. 60, 70, 80, 90, just in this one area. That water is thick with dolphins. Everywhere I look, a dolphin fin just pops into view. We have hit the super pod. These are short, beaked common dolphins. And with our underwater cameras, it's easy to identify them by the characteristic hourglass pattern on their flanks. One of the smallest dolphin species, they're fast swimmers, reaching speeds in excess of 24 kilometers an hour. Oh, wow, look at that! Two meters long, the adults, the youngsters there, and no more than a meter. Oh, beautiful. They're just riding this pressure wave for fun. Common dolphins are one of the most sociable species of dolphin, and superpods tend to consist of lots of family pods travelling together in search of food. Of course, it's a $64,000 question. I can see dolphins jumping all around the boat, bow riding. How many do you reckon are out here? Well, I can see them a mile away over there. Um, it's probably some a mile away over there and a mile over there, and if you just look at the amount we've got in this immediate area, probably another 30 miles of them, yeah? Essentially four figures. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's, that's a thousand, ladies yeah, and gentlemen. Over a yeah. thousand dolphins yeah. around the boat. The team note down the number of dolphins and calves seen, along with the time, location, and conditions. Tim Roblaski works for Habitat Info and is helping Sea Trust use their findings for conservation. So with this mobile technology, once it gets uploaded, we can analyse the data and look for patterns uh, about the whereabouts of these species. So, for example, it might be that they're occurring in particularly deep parts of the ocean or shallow parts of the ocean. So we can hopefully identify these patterns, and using that information, we can inform forward planners. Which means that quicker than ever, conservation measures can be put in place to help protect them. These dolphins will only hang around together in a superpod whilst both the good weather lasts and there's plenty of fish. Then they'll head off in different directions following other sources of food. There are not many spectacles I haven't seen either in Britain or around its shores. And until today, a superpod of common dolphins was in that rare category. And it's thanks to the work of Cliff and his team that we know they're here. And with that knowledge, hopefully, we can protect them in these wonderful seas for generations to come. Oh,